everything that we do is for these patients who have lost their missing limbs, right? A company wants to provide feelings amputees haven't felt in years. Psionic is now reinventing the way people with missing limbs live. That's right. I visited the mastermind behind this groundbreaking project. And as I found out, it's technology that has the touch to change lives. Bionic limbs is something I've wanted to do my entire life, ever since I was seven years old. Adil Akhtar's entire life of planning boiled down to this. This is our bionic ability hand right over here. And so all five fingers flex and extend, the thumb rotates as well. A bionic hand born out of the desire to give back to people who lost their limbs. My parents are from Pakistan and I was uh, visiting when I was seven. And that's the first time I met someone with a limb difference. And she was my age, missing her right leg, using a tree branch as a crutch, living in poverty. And that's what inspired me to go into this field. The bionic hand does everything a normal hand would. Here's the power grip right over here. And then if I flip it over here, then you can give someone a thumbs up. Or... And adds a unique and personal touch. You'll actually hear a vibration that's coming through every time that I'm touching the index finger. It can feel. And that allows the patient to know when they've touched an object, how hard they're touching the object, and when they've let go of the object as well. And, so and it's all controlled with residual muscles in the amputated arm. Tear it off. Yeah, there you go. The hands are built from scratch at the University of Illinois. Now, right now, there's a camera in front of us, and that's kind of dictate how this hand moves. So we got the hand right here. Hello. <laughs> the first bionic hand went to a Champagne Army veteran who lost his arm in Iraq. And he used a hook on a daily basis. With our hand, because things like touch feedback, he can actually feel his daughter's hand when he's holding it. And that feeling is the one that motivated Akhtar from the start. That's why we do everything that we do, is so that patients like him can get, uh, like, you know, this, this, um, these feelings back that they wouldn't uh, have been able to do before. There are currently 50 bionic hands across the country and they're covered under Medicare. Actor says that has expanded the access to 75% more U.S. patients. And I asked him if legs and feet are also in the picture. He said he's working on it. 